according to the region's winning head of the Lake Schools. Ballarat Grammar and Ballarat Clarendon College squads will spearhead the city's attack at the Nationals on Friday after dominating yesterday's regatta. St Pat showed plenty of aggression in the stands. It was a different story on the water, hmm. I and mean, for a fourth straight title, its first crew was quick out of the blocks, but Grammar, College and High were all up to the task. After one kilometre, Ballarat Grammar made its move. But it looks like Grammar stroking away. Grammar crossed the line to claim its first boys head of the lake title since 2006. <laughs> Ballarat Clarendon College claimed second, St Pat's took third in a photo finish. In the girls' head of the lake, Ballarat Clarendon College again proved too strong, edging out Ballarat Grammar for the second year in a row. Yeah. With just one team member in year 12, the girls are confident of a third title in the regatta so for us, to Lake Wendere next year. It is good like, to know that there's still three of us there, and, but and then again, anyone can win. St Pat's won the overall boys' trophy, Grammar and College tied for the overall girls' trophy. Grammar celebrated its success at an assembly this afternoon. Do you, you realise that all that hard work throughout all the season, it's, it's finally paid off? Attention now turns to the Nationals to be held in Adelaide this Friday. All five Ballarat schools are sending teams. It's just a, it's a really good thing um, for, for rowing in general in Ballarat. Always being out to train, you know, day and night or so on, whenever, is definitely helping us. Patrick Mitchell, we're news. Luke. And coming up.